Hi, thanks for watching Crime Live. I'm Sergeant Craig Gunlock. One of a parent's greatest fears is finding that their child has been abducted by a stranger. And while there are things that parents can do to help prevent this from happening, such as talking to their children about stranger danger or telling their children what they should do if approached by someone, there are other things that they can do that can help investigators find their children if something like that does happen. DNA kits are one of those things. The Modesto Police Department offers DNA kits to parents and gives instructions on how to complete those kits. Having a DNA sample available for investigators is the most reliable form of identifying children and tracking them if, if something like that should happen. Here's how you can find out more information about DNA kits. Hi. I'm uh, Rosie Fabella, and I'm a crime prevention officer with the Modesto Police Department. And we Guess are here. Mom works. Really? <laughs> and we're here because we have some DNA kits that we'd like to share with you parents for your children. Uh, DNA kits are very easy to do. We have in here a, a cotton swab. And you do the inside of your child's mouth. You're going to swab the inside of the child's mouth, okay? Well, it's a good way to um, identify a child or teenagers or even adults in case they come up missing and there's no other way of communicating. We have the DNA kit to, to uh, go to. You want to do it firmly so that you do get the DNA from the inside of the mouth. And then what you're going to do with the cotton swab is after you swab the inside of the child's mouth, you're going to stick it into a, the bottom of a styrofoam cup. Now, is that hurting at all? Uh -uh. No, it doesn't hurt, does it? And then you're going to get the cotton swab and you're going to poke it and you're going to let it stay in there, for, like I say, 24 hours so it has time to thoroughly dry. And then you're going to put it into the freezer. And here is the envelope. And if you have more than one child, um, we have a spot here for you to put your child's name, their date of birth, and the date that you did the cotton How spot. long does that last? It's forever? good forever, okay. yes. So, I mean, we've even suggested that uh, for children, small children, teenagers, and even adults, if you'd like to do it for, uh, for them also. And it keeps forever in your freezer. Do you kids know what a stranger is? What's a stranger? It's a person. Very good. I'm glad to hear that. What's a good stranger? A, a, a good stranger is say a police officer, somebody, and they're in a uniform with the police department. A teacher? Would that be a good stranger? A teacher? Now, if you were playing in the park and a stranger was to come up and start talking to you, would you talk to that stranger? No. No, you wouldn't talk to that stranger, would you? You what run if, away. You run away. Very Perfect. Good. And what would you say while you were running away? No! No, run! Run, run, run! Oh, run, 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 run. Let's hear yeah. it just a little louder. One, two, three. Wow! Oh, very good. Give now, me guys Officer Bronda, would you like to have them take the oath so they could be a junior yes, police five, officers? Are you ready? <laughs> get your hand. get your hand and repeat after me. Are you ready? I promise, I promise. to listen to my parents and be a terrific kid. Be a terrific kid. Give them a hand, parents. Are now Yay. Yay! Here you go, and here you go. Let's stick this on you here. You're now an official junior police officer. Congratulations. One of a parent's greatest fears is having their child abducted by a stranger. And while there are things that we can do to help prevent that, we can also, as parents, help protect our children by completing one of these DNA kits that we've shown here. If you have any questions about DNA kits or how to find one, please don't hesitate to call. The number's on your screen. Thank you for watching Crime Live. I'm Sergeant Craig Gunlock. We'll see you on the next one.